We have to bring that to light so that people know. My name is Lucia Dunn. I'm a professor of economics at Ohio State University in Columbus, Ohio. I've been a Falun Dafa practitioner for almost 15 years. The main benefit I got from becoming a Falun Dafa practitioner was that it changed my mind and my thinking, and that's really hard to do in people when they get older. You know, when they become adults, it's so hard, and that was sort of the miraculous thing about it. It changed the whole way I viewed things. Um, I started living my life by truthfulness, compassion, and forbearance, and it just changed everything. It made everything in my, in my family happier. There was more harmony in my family. Um, I appreciated my husband more. My husband's always tried to live by Jin Shan Ren. So it had a lot of benefits for my family. They all noticed that I had become easier to live with. And I think it just helped me do a better job. I think my students benefited. I think my research benefited. I became more productive because I gave up a lot of attachments about to things that I was worried about all the time. It helped me get a clearer vision of what life was all about, what the purpose of life was, what I needed to do in my life. In 2006, when we first got the news about the forced organ harvesting, we've done a lot of work with organ harvesting. We um, have collected thousands of signatures on the Doctors Against Forced Organ Harvesting petition that goes to the United Nations Human Rights Commission every year. I mean, everybody needs to, to inform themselves about what, go, what is going on. You know, what's going on in China now, especially with the organ harvesting, is a threat to our whole civilization. It changes the very basic meaning of what it is to be a human being. Um, when you can treat a, a living human being as industrial merchandise, which is what that organ harvesting does. And you need to think about what our life is gonna be like for our children and our grandchildren. And everybody needs to you know, stand up and oppose that.